To perform a basic startup on the ABB ACS380, begin by powering on the drive. It will ask you to select the appropriate unit, either US or international, and press OK to confirm your choice. The drive will now recognize the connected adapter and set the correct settings. This may take a few seconds depending on the adapter that is connected. Now, select the appropriate motor type in the motor data view. ASIN M for an asynchronous motor, PMSM for a permanent magnet motor, or SYN RM for a synchronous reluctance motor. Next, select the motor control mode. Your options are vector control or scalar mode. Vector should be suitable for most cases. The drive will do an automatic standstill ID run. The other control mode option is scalar. You should use this mode when the number of motors can change or the nominal motor current is less than 20% of the nominal drive current. Please note that the scalar mode is not recommended for permanent magnet motors. From here, you should set the nominal motor values, including power, current, frequency, voltage, speed, cosine, and optionally torque if desired. Examine the direction of the motor. If it is rotating in the incorrect direction as displayed, then you can reverse the direction using either the phase order setting or with the phase order of the motor cable. Set the start and stop mode in the motor control view, if desired. Next, set the maximum and minimum speeds. In the Control Macros view, select the applicable macro. For units with a field bus adapter connected, you can see the field bus in the Control Macros view. Some parameters may need further adjustment based on your configuration and application. When you are ready to test your drive, press the Start button to begin the test run. If everything works as configured and no faults appear, then you are now ready to begin using your drive. You can see our full selection of drives and more at galco.com.